So the Manchester Cancer Research Centre was established in 2006 and is a partnership between the University of Manchester, Cancer Research UK and the Christie. And the aim of this partnership is to really bring together the cancer research activities in these three great organisations. Cancer patients are very different from each other and yet in the past we've treated patients as if they're all the same. That's not uh, the way that we'll treat patients in the future. In the future, we'll take the characteristics of individual patients and use that knowledge to really guide us in the best treatment that might be most effective for that particular patient. That's what we call personalised medicine, and the whole ethos of the Manchester Cancer Research Centre really is to drive uh, that personalised medicine future uh, in Manchester. Well, BRCA2 gene is a mutated gene that they've realised actually um, causes breast cancer and can be the cause of other female cancers. I obviously got the cancer and was diagnosed as being a carrier which affects obviously our children and future generations in our family. I've been coming to the Christie for over 13 years now and I'm always absolutely amazed at every time I need to change treatment that I'm offered um, a choice of very different treatments and I've been very lucky enough to have personalised medicine um, through the work of Cancer Research UK here at the Christie so it is invaluable to us as a family but certainly for um, other families and people who suffer from cancer. So in the UK alone over 300,000 people are diagnosed with cancer every year. It's a big problem because essentially we live longer so there's a huge challenge ahead of us and the only way that we're going to meet this challenge is through more research. And it's places like the Manchester Cancer Research Centre that's really going to trailblaze. We need to bring scientists, clinicians together uh, on one site, really interacting with each other, so we can really take discovery right through uh, to clinical practice.